India has six classical languages, Tamil, Sanskrit, Telugu, Kannada, Malayalam and Odia. Hindi and English are its two official languages and there are 22 languages which are called the scheduled languages of India. But for many, there is one problem. India does not have one single national language. But should that be a problem? In terms of total speakers, Hindi is already spoken by the greatest number of people. Before I go further into this, let me show you how beautiful Indian languages sound. This is Tamil. This is a Ladakhi dialect. The language that you have just heard is from Assam. This one is Mizo. Ratrandivasa Namata Wuchara Ratrandivasa Namata Wuchara Ratrandivasa Tulasi Malagala Go Pich and Nana Tila Tulasi Malagala Go Pich and That was Marathi. And that one was Hindi. The actual language diversity of India is much greater. According to the People's Linguistic Survey of India, India has over 780 languages and 66 separate scripts. And the researchers believe that there are at least 100 more languages that were not reported in the survey. You will be surprised to know that Arunachal Pradesh alone has 90 languages and West Bengal has the greatest number of scripts among all states totaling 9. Assam with its 55 languages, Gujarat with 48, and Maharashtra with 39 are some of the most linguistically diverse states of India. However, in the 2001 census of India, in which a different calculation method was used, it was reported that there are nearly 1600 other languages and 122 major languages. As far as Sanskrit is concerned, it is still spoken in a few villages, including Jiri of Madhya Pradesh, Hoshali and Mathura of Karnataka, and Sasana of Orissa. It is said that Sanskrit has a strong influence on many Indian languages, and it is important to point out that even today, Sanskrit continues to be widely used in everyday prayers, wedding ceremonies, cremation ceremonies, and many other important Hindu religious events across India, regardless of the local regional language. Unfortunately, many languages in India are slowly disappearing. It is estimated that around 220 languages have disappeared in the last 50 years and another 150 could become extinct in the next five decades. So should India have a national language? Well, if people in the southern region of India are expected to learn Hindi as a compulsory subject in school, why the people in the north should not be given some South Indian language as a compulsory subject? That would sound more like mutual respect. Or how about making it compulsory for Hindi-speaking people to learn at least one language from the non-Hindi regions? Doesn't that sound fair? Isn't it right to say that learning each other's language can build new bridges as long as one's own native language is well preserved? Something that having one national language will create a more socially cohesive society. Others don't. 
What is your take on this? See you again.